The other thing that um he touched on, the Mac on in the YouTube video, was how when people trigger you, it's basically just asking you to delve within yourself and look at what areas you need to self-improve in. Because essentially, it's not about having judgments towards people. It's about being okay with what is and knowing that, that their treatment of you or whatever the case may be, that's a part of their journey. Um, and not necessarily yours. So basically, when you do accept this mistreatment, these lies, this deceit, you're send sending a signal to the universe that it's that you still haven't learned the lesson. So they're going to keep sending you <laughs> these people to show you that it's not okay for you to be treated in that way or be loved in that way. And this is going to come in the form of not only romantic relationships, this is going to come in the form of fam family relationships. This is going to come in the form of friendships. Until you get it into your head that just because you've known someone for this amount of time and you've gone through whatever it is that you've gone through, it does not give someone the right to mistreat you. It does not give you some someone the right to abuse you. You have to reach that level where you are okay being by yourself until those right people that can love you like you do come along that can treat you and respect you like you do appear in your life when you are ready the universe will provide get out of that lack mentality get out of that mentality oh i don't have any friends I don't have, I, I can't relate to anyone. I, no one understands me because that's the frequency you're emitting to the universe. Same thing as abundance, right? You tell people to not think about, oh, don't ever say the word broke. Don't ever say you're alone because you're not. You're not alone. If you go through life thinking, I'm going to end up alone. I'm not going to find anyone like me. Guess what? That's what the universe is going to give you. Because that's what you're asking for. Your words and your thoughts have power. They create your reality. Part of the spiritual awakening is going through this process where you have to delete people from your life who hurt you, that cause you pain. And know that you are worthy of being loved and treated the way that you love.